tensions have not settled since last night's riot. When I arrived at the Backwater Bridge, my photographer and I were greeted with a woman yelling at us, calling us liars. She went as far as to tell me to go to the front line and hoped I was the next person to be shot. A group of over 20 people surrounded us, took our photos, and told us to tell the truth. Eventually, we were able to move past them and cover the story. While I was in Cannonball, I got a chance to speak with the spiritual leader about last night's confrontation. Last night, about 400 protesters illegally trespassed on the Backwater Bridge, trying to pass the blockades. About a dozen fires were set near the bridge and the Red Warrior Camp. Law enforcement officers remained on the scene until the bridge was cleared early Monday morning. Terry Martinez is an elder at the camp. I joined them because as a spiritual leader, you have to be with your people. So I too was sprayed, canonized, concussion cannon, shot with rubber bullets. He says the riot was started by eight DAPL protesters. Where are those people who did this? Why are, not, why are they not coming forth? Will they be removed from the camp? Most likely. Yes, we were very, when you do wrong, you get removed. You will be escorted with security. You will take your whole camp. We don't deal with that. We went, this is a prayer place. Nine protesters were taken to Sanford and six to St. Alexius. Some are taken to this, uh, with broken fingers and uh, skint up legs and, and fractures. And uh, some are from the concussion cannon to the spraying of the bullets. And that's how most of them got injured. Milani Stoneman was the medic that treated Martinez after he was injured. There's still some accountability that has to be held, not only on our side, but the accountability that has to be held on, on that side mm. too. Martinez says there is no place for anger at the camp. I'm standing here before them and leading our people. That's our job. We stand with the people. Terry Martinez said he will meet with the camp elders about the eight protesters who instigated the riot last night.